People who have no intention to come to Israel, Eritrean refugees who are forced to flee Eritrea, uh, flee for their lives. You can hear about stories of people who had a blanket wrapped around their head and they were put on the back of a truck. Around 4,000 Eritreans have been killed by the Bedouins in Sinai. I stayed in Sinai for five months and two weeks and it's too difficult to speak about that place. Sinai means no man land. They can do whatever they want to do over you without any uh, mercy at all. We were getting phone calls from hostages in Sinai asking, begging for our help. I have an agreement with them to pay them 2700 After I was paying that money, they want more money. We must pay $20,000. We don't have that much money because we come from the poor country. They have to be held for a long time until everybody they've ever met has donated money for their release. Kau bak ab tagazam skanana khastay bagi sam nama rutin Israel ni homilam nab sina. Ab sina kah shidi shawar hajar nama rutin. Shidi shawar hajar kagab berkhalo hawa betami masai tunir nagera matkat niru. So they'll burn them, they'll um, brand them with burning out cigarettes. They burn them with fire, they pour filmy plastic on their butts. Hanging people uh, from the ceiling for, for days at a time, if not weeks. They are already chained in that camp and they start to hit us without any reason. We have two pregnant women. He beat them badly. I will <laughs> remove the child, he says, like that every day. Torturing, uh, organ harvesting. He make surgery and we sell all the tissues, organs. We become scared of human beings, that's it. All of these torture methods are there so that their families hear them screaming. Everybody love money. They are heartless. By making two wrong things, you don't make any right thing. The only thing is, I must forgive them. If I forgive them, they will be, they will be human beings.